G'day guys. Saturday morning here. Week's work's done. Lawns have been done. Domestic chores have been done. Time for some fun in the shed. This pile of wood's gonna end up as a coffee table. The work we're gonna do in the shed today is carry on working on a coffee table that I'm gonna be building. What I'm doing is I've gotta first flatten the slab. Now you can see I've already done one side on this slab. I've uh, leveled it, smoothed it, and finished it. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the process I use to take a rough side like that into a, a smooth, finished, almost finished side like that. Um, so I'll take you through the process. We'll be using three planes. Obviously it's too wide to go through my thicknesser. So it's all going to have to be done by hand. You could, of course, use a router sled to level it and smooth it out, but I prefer um, using hand planes. And with a, a good scrub plane, good sharp, uh, long um, seven inch plane, smoothing plane and a scrub plane, it, it's, it's a relatively easy, easy process. So the first things we've got to do is we've got to mark the thickness, because as you can see, that's thinner, that's thicker. So we'll take the marking gauge and we'll mark around the edge so we can finish this side as it, and leave it all the same thickness. So we'll crack on and do that. 30 mil. So we've marked the board out. Um, there's, there's probably about 10 mil to take off this edge. And there's probably two or three mil off the front edge here so that it, it cuts down into there. So we'll focus on taking this edge off first, bringing that down parallel with this edge, and then we'll start smoothing and leveling it out. So we're gonna start with what they call a scrubbing plane, uh, you know, um, I'm no expert on this, I'm no expert on this, um, all I know is I use a number four plane, just a Stanley number four, and the secret to a scrub plane is the blade. The blade is, is curved. So you can see blade's got a curve in it. It's not flat, it's got a round curve in it. Find the edge and I'll work around the edge from corner to corner. Leaving plenty of space for uh, the chip breaker so when you're taking large chips it doesn't gum up in the in the chip breaker. Another important difference between a scrub plane is the gap in the throat here. See the scrub plane has a very wide open throat to allow the large chip through. Unlike the smoothing plane which has a very narrow throat to help stop um, chip out. <laughs> Thank you. 
CSA takes concave chips instead of big long flat chips like a normal plane. Bit of wax. Just to check on that, the straight edge on the edge here, we're looking pretty good. One on each end, high through the middle. So that's where we're at at the moment. The scrub plane, you see we're almost level on the edge there, all the way through. And we can start working our way across the whole board at the moment. This side, you can see, I know girls, and log. Okay, yep, I know. Hello. Yes, I know I'm popular. And see, we're level across there, but we've still got more to come off this edge here.
So, check the eye diagonal now. We're good, we're a bit higher here. Same here. So, still a bit higher on this edge here. Which is right, because I think this is the scrub plane finished so we've got it mostly flat now it's the process of starting to smooth it out and then with that we'll start with the baiting number seven nice long flat plane which will help us level it all off and flatten it all off bit of a hollow here and it's slightly higher here that's why I was working this area here I'm looking pretty good everywhere else a bit high up this end
no need to go to the gym. That's looking pretty good. You can see we've taken out all the cupping that was created by the scrub plane. We've taken it down nice and nicely onto the line. You can just see uh, that's the bottom of the line there. And on this side, you can just see us cutting the line in half here. Same with up here. You can just see us cutting the line in half here. And on this side as well. Just there. So the board's relatively flat and even. So next stage we'll be going on to the smoothing plane, just to flatten everything off and make it nice and smooth. On to the next stage. Which is smoothing. Using a smoothing plane. All right. So we've got a big pile of wood shavings after the flattening. Starting with the scrub plane, heavy concave chip running across the grain. You can see. Then running to the next chip, which is the leveling and flattening, which is a still quite a heavy, heavy chip coming off the planer. Then finally, the real fine, thin strips that come off the planer, the smoothing planer. Leaving a big pile of mess to clean up. 
So that's the top flattened and planed. Both sides are done. Both sides are parallel to each other. They're cleaned up and ready for um, final proportioning and slabbing for the tabletop. The, um, the time taken to do that, probably, um, it was probably about 40 minutes with the scrub plane, 40 minutes with the number seven, the big plane, and then probably 30 minutes actual plane time with the finishing plane to get the board to this level. A bit of effort, good workout, got a bit of a sweat up, but uh, um, I, I enjoy it, especially when the plane's sharp and, and, and you get nice results. As I say, this is ready to go for the next stage, so that'll be in the next video, the next part of the coffee table. Um, so on to the next stage.